Hello everybody, it is your good friend once again, Leaf here, with another mod showcase. Welcome everyone, if you're new here, be sure to check out the old mod showcases, because you know, this is turning into a little bit of a series by now. But you guys can see, we have some interesting biomes that we're going to cover, especially some like aquatic ones, so you guys know what that means, right? <laughs> so yeah, we're just going to like start start to get into it you know so havoc has reached out to me and brought up their replacement remasters not really sure what you call them but damn these guys look good so these are the original west african lions and you can see that they look absolutely stunning especially the male let me just pull him over here because we need to get like a good look at him he is absolutely beautiful a look at that so no longer will we have like cartoonifying veins we have oh my god they're so loud <laughs> they are beautiful they look gorgeous their manes actually look good i so normally i really wasn't into like these remasters or replacements i was like you know the frontier art style is fine on its own no these have changed my mind like absolutely uh, is that a little bit? No, I thought I saw a little lot problem. That is so cute. Did we see that? Cause that's adorable. Oh my God. But yeah, we have a lot more by Havoc here. So over here we have their Bengal tigers. And yeah, like there's not much to say other than the fact that they look so much more realistic. They're absolutely gorgeous, too. I'm pretty sure he even redid some of the texturing and all the stripes. So amazing job on that. Like, Havoc, this is some of, like, the best work I've seen in-game. Uh, and we have one last one by you. I know I skipped over the Jaguar, but we're going to get to that next week. But right now, we have our little Snow Leopard, and wow. Like, you do so good at this. I have no idea how you do this, because they look gorgeous they look stunning and i don't know what else to say like you do such an amazing job so if you guys don't have these already you must go get them right now because there's one thing about like frontier art style and like frontiers work and i know a lot of people complain that like oh yeah you know like a lot of the mods don't match up to frontiers quality or whatnot these absolutely blow it out of the water so amazing job amazing amazing job havoc now we're going to revisit one of the mods from last week, actually. We have one from Hoxton Mods, and this is the South American Tapir, and damn, Hoxton, you really nailed it. You took an already good model that you made, and you made it even better. You gave it the little, like, pompadour that it has, you made it a little bit more brown. You really took, like, everything that we said about this guy, and you made it even better. So yeah, if you guys haven't already downloaded this guy, go check him out like as soon as you can, because this is indeed one of the best ones you can have for your zoos. So let's move on a little bit to another one from me. Speaking of tapirs, we actually have the mountain tapir, and these guys are absolute gorgeous creatures. You can see that they're even a lot more fluffier than your normal tapir. They have this little iconic like white mouth. And I think it's, you know, they're funky looking creatures, you know, and they have that little like patch of brown on there. So yeah, if you guys haven't already checked this one out, I hear, I hear, you know, the uh, maker of that is pretty, pretty good. Yeah. I mean, look at that. I mean, how could you not want to download someone with a name like that? All right. <laughs> All right. So let's get into the other ones that I made. So actually, I need to fix this because... J2 Bex actually made this one over here. This is the Indian Gower, and they are gorgeous creatures. They are beautiful, they're striking, and they're huge. Now, these are the largest bovines in the world, and they really show it. I mean, they're beautiful creatures, and, you know, they're perfect for all of your zoo. So be sure to go check them out as soon as you can. And here we go for a little domestic pig. Now, I kind of ran out of room because I'm starting to use the same template over and over, and I swear next one, next mod showcase, I'll dress it up too. But yeah, here we have the little domestic pig, and actually the full name of it is the large white pig. I know it's kind of a bad name, but you know, that's what they came up with it, you know, the Brits, you know how they are. 
But um, yeah, these are perfect for any like petting zoo. They're perfect for anything really like that. And I love them. And they're part of like the unofficial like farm pack that me and Nick are working on. So be sure to check them out as soon as you can. I think they are absolutely adorable. And yeah. So moving on. Actually, let's tackle the uh, wild ass first. Now, this was originally made by J2Bex. Originally made by J2Bex. I can't even talk anymore, guys. Then again, I haven't really from the start. But yeah, these guys are striking. They are critically endangered, which is really interesting because, you know, I don't, I don't know. You just would, would have never thought of that. There's only like 700 in the wild, which is, you know, it's kind of sad, but, you know, maybe you guys can breed them up in your own zoos and start to work on the conservation because, you know, these guys are beautiful. They're related to the zebra, which is really cool. And yeah. I love that. <laughs> the albinos have like these bright blue eyes, which come from the zebra, and I think it's, I kept it in there because, you know, it just looks nice. But yeah, they are beautiful. Let's see what else we have for today. So, if we visit over here, you guys might think that these are, you know, just normal king penguins from Glance Up. But no, these are actually the emperor penguin, which, you know, it would have been my first pick for the aquatic pack. Like, I don't know, the king penguins, they're just kind of like, they're all right. But no, these guys are so much better. I love how they look. They were made by our lovely friend, Giorno. And yeah, they deep dive. They do everything that you need them to do. They're just like the penguins. You do need the aquatic pack for them, which, you know, I mean, we're not doing charity work over here. <laughs> But yeah, they're beautiful, and you know, they're perfect for your penguin houses. And speaking of those penguin houses, we're visiting another mod made by me. I can't even talk anymore. But yeah, these are the lovely little chin strap penguins. And yeah, there's not much to say about them other than the fact that they look like they have little chin straps. Love them. They're just little chunky guys. But yeah, these are the newest penguin well there's two new penguins and i'm pretty sure today nick will have already released his african penguin i know he's been having trouble with that so if that's already out do check that out but yeah this is pretty much it for our week uh i kind of made sure to go extra hard on my own mods just to make sure that we had some stuff for this week and yeah i'm happy you guys are sticking along of course they're pooping because you know it wouldn't be a youtube video of planet zoo without them pooping i'm everyone's pooping i don't know why <laughs> yeah these are some amazing mods and i really do hope you guys check all of them out it's an amazing week this week and there's so much awesome stuff and it seems like the mod like modding community is becoming really really awesome so be sure to check out all the modding servers if you haven't already. I'll link them down below. And yeah, like that, I think we can call it there. So thank you guys so much for watching. And I do hope you all have the most wonderful days. Take care.